Hi, good evening, Ele. Hello, teacher. Good afternoon. Good morning. Good night. Good, <laughs> hey, good evening, Ele. And how are you? I'm fine, teacher. And uh, you? Um, I'm fine as well. Uh, starting the week. Uh, tell me, how was your how was your weekend? Uh, I think so. Normal. It's routine, normal, but I don't like it. Uh, only no, I don't have no. Quiero ver qué es. Okay, yes. Novelty, esa palabra que olvidé. <laughs> which, which one? Uh, I don't have novelty. In my opinion. No oh, novedad. Ah. Mm -hmm. That means that everything has been uh, going on kind of the same. Yeah. What but do you... at least I, I like my routine. I what do you guess. what do you normally do on, on I mean on weekends? Uh I go uh I was go I was go to uh to the church. Uh it's normal in the weekend uh, uh, meet uh, meet my family in the downtown in the in the church in my grandpa. Uh this is normal. Uh, visit my grandpa. My grandma, and I have it a, a best meat. It's a salvage meat because in my cousin, my uncle, uh, different people. Yeah, my yeah. It's, it's, it's very it's interesting, but it's a relaxing for me. It's, it's my normal, uh, normal. Is I cooking in the the grandma? Grand, yes. It's my routine in the in in Sunday. Uh, I go I go to the church in, in the morning. In the morning, I go to the church, and in the afternoon, I watch TV or watch series. It's my normal day. That that's nice. I mean, that's a very relaxing. Um, yeah, my life is very simple. I don't I don't like it. I remember the the another uh, etapa época epoch uh, another epoch. Uh, uh, I have a more, a more active, for example, a visit to the, the different downtown. Oh, I go to the uh, supermarket. Oh, I go to the the cinema. I watch the movies. Uh, I visit the restaurant. But I, uh, al final, I don't. I don't. I, rem I don't remember. How do you say cancer? It's stressful. More stressful in the in the Wednesday for different activities. And so it's not relaxed for me. It's not relaxed. The I mean, uh, the things that you do on Wednesday. Mm. Or or at least not relaxing like to go to the the supermarket and do those 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 things. No, uh, I'm my expression is is in the in the weekend. Uh huh. I I different things activities, but it's it's normal. The the I don't I don't I don't prefer a different thing activities in in another situation or another time. I I like I have a, my weekend is very active. O sea, I tenía muchas actividades. Mm -hmm. 
but in the in the moment oh, it's normal the usual i prefer uh, buy in the tienda mm -hmm. like the, the at the store i say i i prefer buying the store uh, for the, my downtown mm -hmm. i don't like the the visit the supermarket but it's more in the supermarket in my opinion is the moment is more expensive uh different uh the store in the neighborhood exactly so sometimes it is uh a little bit more expensive uh, buying the things at the supermarket than in, than in, than in the local market. Okay, local market, yeah. I mean, I, I mean the local market, I mean, when, when there are like people that go and take those like uh, fruits, vegetables to sell them close to the community. I think that the other one is like the, the grocery, grocery stuff, I mean, the grocery yeah store. yeah is the is the is the is the more sensitive it, it, it's normal the local store it, the people the is more sensitive for the cost but is i prefer is the ganar by i go ganar poco como es eh, early light y uh, uh different the, the supermarket but for example in my downtown uh the buy uh, the tomato buy in the in the productor local yeah. the, the different uh, store uh, store is more is more spa uh, it's more cheap uh, the because the the local store a provis eh, de el productor local provee algunos vegetable for the the local store. Entonces es more cheap. Es cheaper. Yeah. For example, eh, de bananas. Eh, depending the the cost of the people, eh, bananas este uh, twenty. Eh, Teacher, how do you say una gaja por un dólar? <laughs> yeah, I don't remember <laughs> that. Yeah, but it's, 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 it's the really situation in the downtown. Uh, it's, it's, it's the more cheap in different uh, vegetable and fruit. Yeah. Por ejemplo, una gaja de, de banana me cuesta un dólar. Like the bunch, a bunch of bananas. Yeah, a bunch of banana, one dollar. For example, eh, eh, de esos mangos, los que hacen mangos en flor, de esos gigantes, uh -huh. eh, están a cinco por el dólar aquí. Ah, really? Yeah. Oh, yes, yeah, so it, it's, so it's much better to buy things there. Yeah, yeah, it's more cheap. <laughs> yeah. Entonces, but I prefer to eh, buy in the in the local store. Okay. But it's my experience. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes, actually, I mean, that is the purpose. Good. I'm going to try to spend less money and get more. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, yeah. In, in, in the specific moment, the specific moment that they'll, that they'll, that they'll buy the, the, their money is very expensive in general. I think it's so more strategic. Yes. For less money. Uh -huh, yes. Good. Uh, thank you, Ele. Now I can see that Dan Francisco, Diego, Avelin, and Donis are already here. Uh, Diego, uh, good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Diego. Good yeah. evening, everyone. Tell us, uh, how was uh, your weekend? What do you do? Uh, Mm, well, uh, for example, uh, some uh, some tired <laughs> because, for example, the Saturday uh, in the morning I received uh, classes from the university, and then I I went to work <laughs> uh, until the night. 
And the next day go go to work in the morning and and it came it came earlier at the house but it do some homeworks and yeah kind kind of tired it practically that okay so it is like uh uh busy i mean like uh yes i mean sometimes uh you can think that the weekend you're going to rest but sometimes you use the weekend to finish all the things that you have like a pending like for example yeah. homework other activities yeah so that's yes <laughs> that usually yes. happens to me yes i think that was very busy especially because uh uh, we are finishing a uh, I don't know how to say the uh, semester? yes the semester yes so we are uh, more busy now yes trying to finish all the the last activities yes uh, yes the final exams and all of that I just imagine the stress of the finals <laughs> yes the last activities Okay, but, yes, definitely. but what do you think? Do you think that you're doing great <laughs> or that you that you need like a, a miracle? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, we don't know. We we still don't know. <laughs> we we need to to know some some great, but I hope <laughs> I hope to to pass all the. Uh, how can I say materials? I don't know. The subjects. Yes, I have to pass all the subjects, but yes, uh, we we still have to complete uh, a lot of activities and exams. So uh, depending on of this month, practically. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, I had I hope that you can make it. Uh, because I mean it's difficult. It's an extra effort. I mean, it's a big effort, a huge effort that, yeah. that you're putting, like a train to study, work, and study at night as well. So I you, yes. So I hope that you can make it. <laughs> yes, I hope so. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, thank you, Diego. Well, let's see. Uh, Evelyn? You... Good evening. Hello, Evelyn. Uh, good evening. Tell us, um, how was your weekend? Well, I uh, Saturday I have to work, and on Sunday. I stay here in my home and I was uh, resting <laughs> all of day. Uh, I was doing some of uh, some of activities here like cooking and uh, cleaning. <laughs> dedicating time to to the house uh, activities to the house the house duties yes <laughs> and that is another thing that uh, sometimes I mean in, uh, not on the weekend it is a time that we can like uh, dedicate time to the things of uh, the house like cleaning organizing things So, yes, the my day off. Uh, usually, I have to cooking my food for the for the week, and I have to clean the house and my my room and. And washing the, the the clothes. That's 
Uh, yes, I mean, those are some of the things that I also do during the weekend. So, yes, uh, I mean, doing the things that we cannot do during the week. So, okay, so yeah, that, that's, uh, that's, that's good. <laughs> uh, thank you, Evelyn. Uh, I, sometimes I finish the day tired. more tired. <laughs> yes, <laughs> There's, that, that's what, what happens to me. I, I work and I do the things and I say, I mean, after when I finish, I will rest, but then and I will do some of the things. And then when I finish to, to do the uh, my tasks, and then I, I finish and I'm tired and I don't want to do, I, I don't want to do anything else. Just sleep. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I, I, I feel you. I understand you. <laughs> I understand that part. Okay, nice, uh, Evelyn. Uh, let's see. Francisco. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you, Francisco? I'm fine, teacher. Fine. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let me uh, ask you something. Well, first... Uh, tell us quickly about your weekend. How was it? Ah, uh, it was. Ah, uh, it was good. Not much. I think just to stay at home. Uh, I I have been continue playing the guitar. Uh, I. Went to the gym for a, an hour. And Sunday, I went to the church as well. Yeah, kind of easy day. Okay, good. And what about tomorrow? What are you going to do tomorrow? Um, Tomorrow, I going to work tomorrow. I really yeah, that's, that's good. Uh, I, I continue uh, uh replacement the roof uh -huh. of my church and I think that I'm going to work tomorrow and uh, and uh, and the noon I go back to the gym. Eh. The thing that unemployment people do it. <laughs> <laughs> That people that dedicate, I mean, time to themselves. Uh, it's, I mean, uh, I mean, uh, I mean uh, right now, at least you can enjoy yourself. <laughs> you can dedicate time to yourself. I, I am, I am, I am doing. Uh, all my life for a long period of time, I work for others. I help others, and I, I never have uh, taken time for me and from January I have taken time for me and I, I take my more time to uh, recover my health or help me my, by myself mm -hmm. and I enjoy my time for me yes exactly so that the, and yes and that is why I was I was mentioning that because it is like uh, many of us probably would like to have the time to do the things that we like, but sometimes because of the uh, of work and sometimes because the other things that we have pending, uh, at the end when we finish, as we were mentioning with Avenue, when you finish to do those things, I mean, at the end, you didn't. You don't even want to like, for example, yeah. You didn't. You didn't. Even, you don't even have energies, like for example, to to go outside or uh to play or to watch things because you. I mean, you fall asleep. You just yeah, want yeah, to... yeah. Maybe yes, maybe not. It's depending how you are feeling at the moment, because I remember a few years ago, I have. I work a lot for maybe 10 hours or 12 hours at the day. And then I, I, uh, 
I went to the gym or maybe to another activity. So it depends how you're feeling at the moment. Right now, I do many things during the day and because I feel healthy and, I, and I'm feeling good. But when you live with depression or with stress, you feeling more uh, more tired. Uh, tired. Mm -hmm. It's actually, I, I think that that can be another reason, another cause. I mean, the routine, the stress. Yes. You, you, you tr I'm sorry. You, you, people, have, people will have to avoid the routine. To try, people have to try to change your routine and doing different things. Especially if you're married, you need to change it, change it, change it every day. Ah, uh, yes. If not, I mean, uh, it is going to be, it, it is going to turn uh, like a monotony. Yes, <laughs> like, that's correct. Like the song. Ah, like the Shakira song? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes, so to finish telling you that the last weekend for me was normal. I enjoyed it, but it was normal because I missed to go to the cinema there. I like. <laughs> ah, yeah. Oh, oh, were you going to watch uh, which movie? What's the next for me, I would like to go to watch The Transformer. I'm waiting for a long time. For, to see the Transformer, the last movie. <laughs> ah, yes. That one uh, looks very nice. Yes. I'm a huge fan of Transformers movie. Ah, uh, really? Yes. I just remember that I watched the, the first three. The first three movies. Uh-huh. Okay. No, you be, you are you are missing the last one. It's, look, I think for me it's better, better than the first one. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, nice. So if I have the chance, I will, I, I will, I will watch it. Yeah, I'll, take I'll your time. To, yes, I'll, I'll try to make some time to watch the movie. Okay, Perfect. nice. Uh, thank you, Francisco. We are going thank to you. uh quick finish with uh, Doris. Doris, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Now tell us uh, quickly, how was your day? I mean, how was your Monday? How was your your beginning of the week? Ah, uh, it was a little tired, but I think that everything is, everything is okay. It was a very good day, and well, I think that um, it was good. <laughs> it was good. What about tomorrow? What are your plans for tomorrow? For tomorrow, I'm going to work in the morning, and in the afternoon, I'm going to stay at home. Yes, <laughs> I don't have any other plans. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's nice. Uh, at least, I mean, you already know. I mean, what what you're going to do? What you're going to do tomorrow? So you're going to stay at home, uh, like watching something. Or doing something. No. I uh, when I stay at home, I usually clean the house mm -hmm. or um, prepare some food for the for my pets or <laughs> sleep. <laughs> uh, to try to recover energies. Yes. I mean, it is really nice when you can sleep at in the afternoon. In that, uh, in the winter, it's very nice to very nice to sleep in the afternoon because the 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 weather it's okay. But when it's the day, it's very hot. We can't sleep at uh, in the afternoon because. Um, how can I say? Hace mucho calor. Because it's very hot. Yes. 
it's hot and and I mean and yes that that's that's right I mean these days uh, have been really hot and yes. when you sleep uh, in the afternoon when you wake up you are all sweat yes that's correct yes I mean that's I mean that's right I mean that's one of the bad things about this weather yeah okay okay good now um so we're going to well we start with this one with today's uh topic because I can see that the, the time is running so I was asking you to uh, about your future plans because today's uh topic it is going to be related about that so I am going to share the screen so you can see that today we are going to be talking about the future things we're going to be talking about the will the use of will and also the use of going to so what's the difference we are going to be, we are going to be learning about the difference about these two and how to use them so here we have uh, this chart and let's see now dear Okay. Now, can you help me reading like uh, the uh, the situations, the scenario, the uh, when you use uh, will? Okay. Uh, will versus going to. Uh, will you, you can use will when you express future actions decided at the moment moment of speaking, and an immediate decision. For example, I will have salad now. And going to, you can use it when you express future plans decided before the moment of speaking. Uh, prior plans. For example, I'm going to visit my aunt next Friday. And you can use will to express a prediction based on a personal opinion or experiences. And for example, I think United will win the game. Or for example, to express a future fact. For example, a, the sun will rise tomorrow. And a, for going to, you can express a prediction based on a present evidence. For example, look at those black clouds. It's going to rain. And also to express this, uh, that something is about to happen. For example, get back, the bomb is going to explode. And both will and going to can be used for making future predictions without having a real difference in meaning. Uh, for example, I think it will be foggy tomorrow is the same to say I think it's going to be foggy tomorrow okay very good uh, thank you so you can see the the difference between the use of will and going to uh, going to uh, and will will so you uh, you use will uh, mostly when you are going to use uh, when you make immediate decisions when you're going to make predictions based on opinions and express facts for example another example tomorrow will be tuesday uh for example on this one or a, a, a prediction based on opinion i think that for example let's see uh manchester city is going to win the champions league something like that or a uh, or this one immediate decision, like for example, we will continue with the class. I uh, would going to uh plans that you already had uh before, something that you have already planned in, in advance. Like uh, I will visit my aunt next Friday, I will go to the beach on Saturday, things like those ones. Uh, predictions based on evidence. For example, you can say today that tonight it is not going to rain because it, it doesn't look like it is going to rain. 
or express that something is about to happen. Uh, well, in that one, it's like, for example, that we are going to go with the next slide. Let's see. Uh, here. So here you have the uh, structure, how to use the uh, wheel. Uh, for this one. Future. Yes, future. Now, Ele, help me with this one, with the structure, the positive, negative, <laughs> and question. Okay, simple future tense. Positive from subject, will, and verb. Um, I will start, uh, you will start, he will start, uh, she will start, it will start, we will start, thank you will start, uh, they will start. Uh, excellent. I will come back. Negative four. Subject will uh, not must bear. Okay. I will not uh, start. You will and uh, you won't uh, start. Is uh, he will not start. She won't uh, start. Uh, it won't start. Uh, we will not start. Uh, you will. You, you won't start. Uh, they won't start. Uh, example: I will not want. I will not come back. Oh, oh! I will. I won't. Or I won't come back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ronaldy teacher. Okay. Now, in the last one here, uh, the question for, uh, let's see, Aveline. Okay. Um, will I start? Will you start? Will he start? Will she start? Will it start? Will we start? Will you start? Will they start? Sample, you will come back. Will you come back? Okay, good. Thank you, Evelyn. So you can see here if the if the sentence is you will come back. So when we uh make this one into a question, so we are going to change. So we're going to change the position, the auxiliary. The auxiliary, it is going to be at the beginning. The auxiliary will, it is going to go at the beginning and then the subject. So will you come back? Um, and this one is very easy because you can see that as we have seen, I mean, in the other topics, like for example, the present perfect and, or the continuous, on this one, you don't have for all of the subjects, you're going to use will. So it is not like that you're going to, that for, uh he she and it you're going to use one or for we they and and you you're going to use another form so for all of them you're going to use will and on this one or in negative will not or this is the short the short uh form won't so it is the same will not or won't so you can use any of them or you are going to see any of these ones depending on if you I mean when you read something. Uh let's see some examples here. Ah, we have this other one. Going to. Uh let's see. Now babe. Doris, uh, help me with the positive and negative structure for the use of going to. Okay, teacher. Uh, be going to uh, the form of the and the we can use in a positive form uh, for I, I am, or I'm. He, she, it, we are going to use is or his, she's, it's. Right. Uh, we know that. Uh, you, we, and they, we are going to use are or the uh, contraction form 
And we are going to use going to plus uh, the verb. In this case, we uh, in a sentences, we are going to use, for example, I am going to work in a, in a positive form. And in the negative, we are going to use the subject, I, he, she, it, you, we, they, and we are going to use am, um, or is, or are, and we are going to add not the negative form, right? And we are going to use going to, and the complement work in this case, it's going to be the, the, the principal verb or the verb. And for example, uh, could be, I am not going to work, he is not going to work, or she isn't going to work, you are not going to work, or they aren't going to work. Okay, excellent, very good. So on this one, that is why it is important that uh, that you know the correct uh, use of the verb to be. Because for this one, it is not like a when, when you use the will. I mean, when you express future events with will, because with going to, you need to know the, the correct use of the verb to be. So with I am, he, she, and it is, you, we, they are. And then we have the negative form. That is the same, but we add not. And another important thing is that the verb, the very is in, in, in infinitive, that you, it is without conjugating. So it is like work, going to, work. We always uh, add the going to, going to, and then the verb, going to work, going to eat, going to uh, sleep, going to wash uh, my hands, going to take a shower like that uh, let's see the questions uh francisco uh, for the question form to use going to we need to put the pronoun first like uh, am is and are and then we need to for the going. So example would be, am I going to work? Is he going to work? Are you going to work? And for short answer, just simple put the, the, uh, the pronoun first and the auxiliary. Simple three, uh, is she going to work? Yes, she is. Uh, that's and it. Then, and then you have, if it is positive, you're going to say, yes, she is. Uh, and if it is negative, no, she's it's not. not. It's not. Yes. Uh -huh. And let's see the last one. So we have another one. I mean, at, at, the, at the bottom for this one, um, Evelyn helped me with this, the use. Yes, uh, predictions. Stop the car. We are going to have an accident. Oh, intentions, plans. I'm going to have a drink after work. Okay, good. So we are going to take a look at some examples. Uh, Avelyn, continue with the, let's see. Uh, with the first, let's see. Two sentences. Okay. Uh, number one, I will take out the trash later. Number two, I am going to study for my test tomorrow. Okay, very good. Now, let's see, Helen. Now continue with uh, three and four. Okay, three and four. Yes. I am going to be in a doctor when I grow up. They are going to have a uh, baby's uh, maybe next year. Okay, good. Uh, Diego, uh, five and six. Okay. 
Number five, we will move to a new house next month. Uh, I will go to the party tonight. Okay, good. Uh, that is seven and eight. Okay. I am going to visit my grandparents next week. The sun will rise at 6 a.m. tomorrow. Okay, good. Uh, Francisco. The sun, the sun will set at uh, 8 p.m. tonight. I will finish my homework before I watch TV. Okay, very good. So there you have the example. So uh, we're going to see some other examples now. Let's see. Wait. Mm -hmm. Never wait. Okay, I am going to share this screen so you can see this one. Okay. Now take a look at this one. Yeah. Uh, Let's see, Evelyn, help me with the uh, the first one. What a dark cloud. It's going to rain. It is going to rain. Okay, let's see, let it be. Very good. Now, uh, help me also with, uh, let's see. This one too. I saved money last month, so uh, I am going to travel to London next Monday. Okay, let's see. Yes, excellent. So you have two in a row. Let's see number three. Do they this one too, Mary Evelyn? My friend, um, <laughs> are I going to buy a new car next month? Okay, let's see if you got the third one correct. I very good. So you got the three correct. Excellent. Now we're going to continue with uh, Diego. Now Diego. Okay. Uh, have you decided where to where? Uh, first letter A. Have you decided where you were going to do next Saturday? Yes, we will. No. I mean, I think that's you need to choose one option for both. So which one is the, the one that you okay. For you mm. ah, eh. the first answer letter B, how you decided what what you will do next Saturday. Yes, we are going to go eh, the cinema. Mm, okay, now let's see. I think that we can just choose one. Ah, okay. Yeah. Are going to? Okay, let's try with this one. Well, let's see. Yes, that was the one. So, have you decided what you're going to do next Saturday? Yes, now continue yeah. with this one. Uh, okay, I think Colombia soccer team will win the World Cup. Okay, let's see. 
Hey, excellent. You got it. Uh, what about this one? Uh, where are you going? Uh, I don't know, maybe. Uh, where are you going? No debería de ir on to do, or no? Where are you going to do tonight? Yes, uh -huh, yes, it seems that like it is missing at the two. Ah, okay. uh, I don't know, maybe I will play video game. Which one? Uh, Will. Will. Okay, let's see. Hey, Dave. Good. Yes, that was the one. Now, let's continue with uh, Doris. Okay, teacher. Now, Doris. Teacher, I don't know because I... <laughs> It's a little hard to me to to use will and going to. Uh, I'm going to try, but I'm not sure. <laughs> no, no worries. So that's why we're doing this exercise. Okay. So, will. I will. Okay. Let's see. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> ah. Remember that when you have uh, when you have plans that you decide at the moment, most of the time you are going to use will. If it, if it is something that you have planned in advance, it is going to. So in this uh, example, so you can see that my family and I uh, are going to travel to San Andres in December. So this is something that it seems that they had already planned because they already have the tickets. We have the tickets. So that's okay. that's why and, it is going to. If they don't have the tickets, of they are not sure. Uh yes, exactly. So so if there if it is something that they have decided at the moment that they that they are uh, talking, it is will. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let's try with this one. You don't have. We aren't going to. We don't have any money. We aren't. Yes, we aren't. aren't okay. I think. Let's see. Yes. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Now, dear, what about this one? Why did you need to borrow my suitcase? I am going to visit my mother in Scotland next month. Letter A. I, yes. Okay. Okay. Good. Now you see. Yes. Excellent. Now, uh, thank you, Doris. Uh, let's see. So we are going to continue with uh, we're just missing Francisco and L. So Francisco and then L. Francisco. Okay. The phone rings. I am going to get it. Okay, let's see. Uh, ah. Why it is uh, will? Because it is something that it happened at the moment, so it is like a decision that you just made. Like, uh, so, so I'll get it. Okay. Okay, try with this one. I will drive you to the university tomorrow if you like. Ah, uh, will. Will. Yes, yeah, good. Uh, because it, it is not a decision that has been made yet. Maybe, yes. Mm -hmm. Good. Now, what about this one? Okay, um, I promise I am going to study for the next week 
I am going. No! No, this way. Uh, what but I, if, 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 <laughs> what the is... problem? If he's saying that I promise, he's doing uh, a previous. It is, but probably it is like uh, it is doing the, that decision like at the moment that he's talking. It is like a no, it is like something that hasn't been planned in advance. It is like uh, if I tell you right now that I promise that I'll show you something tomorrow. Okay, I got it. Uh huh. Yes, that's that's why. Now let's see the last three. El. Okay. They are employees. Employees? Uh -huh, employees. Uh, are are going to get a uh, fire if you don't finish the 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 job today. Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Ah, uh, 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 yeah, 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 probably because it was like a decision made on at that moment. Uh, yeah, this one, uh, uh, my mother promised, uh, promise, promise, uh, me, promise me, Tan, she will buy. Uh, my new iPhone cutter, uh, 18, no, 30, 40. 14. 14 when she gets the five. A. You said A. Will. A, yeah. Okay, let's see. Okay, oh. good. And this one. Okay, my girlfriend Cla Carlos and Juana and Joanna. Joanna, Joanna, Juana. Juana. Uh, Juana. <laughs> are going to marry next month. I am also, I, I am so happy for them. Okay. It's plural. Right. Okay, very good. Yes, that one was correct. I am uh, they are going to get married. Nice. Okay, so let's go back to this one. I think that at the beginning probably was a little bit difficult to identify when to use which one. But I think that we're going to do some more practice so you can get that. Uh, wait, wait. Okay, let's see here. Yeah. So here you can see some actions. So we are so we are going to try to make some sentences with these ones. So let's see, um, Evelyn. Yeah. Yes. Take a look at one of these uh, uh, actions that are here. Choose one and make a sentence. I mean, using will or mm -hmm. or going to. Okay. Mm. I am going to dance next Friday night. I am going to what? Sorry. I am going to dance next Friday night. Okay, very good. I am going to dance next Friday night, okay. Do you dance, uh, uh, Evelyn? Yes. <laughs> Pasito Duranquense. <laughs> <laughs> no, that no. kind of music I can't, I can't dance. What type of music do you, do you dance? Like cumbias? Uh... Dance, salsa, merengue, ah. cha that's nice. So when you are like doing the the housework, do you like play some music and then at the same time? No. Yes. Um. Uh. I am cooking. I 
I dancing at the same time or I was cleaning and dancing. Oh yes. I mean that's 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 good. I mean that's that's fun. I mean you didn't you didn't I mean when you do those type of things you don't even feel like that you are doing the housework. Okay, good. Yes. <laughs> now thank you, Avelyn. Now let's see, Doris. Now choose one of the other uh three walk, clink, or run. Mm. Clean, maybe I'm not sure, but I'm going to clean the house this Wednesday. This I don't know. <laughs> Wednesday. Okay. Good. Oh yes, I mean I, I'm going to clean the house this coming Wednesday. Okay, nice. Uh let's see. Let's continue with Diego. No, Diego. Uh, walk, make a sentence with walk or run. Ah, okay. Uh, for example, I'm going to take a walk in the park uh, when I, I, I don't know, how, how can I say, when I stay de vacaciones, when I, when I am, I am on vacation, vacation. Ah, okay. Uh, I'm going to take a walk in the park when I when I'm on vacations. Ah, okay. Good. Very good. Thank you. Let's see. Uh, um, Ellie. Good teacher. With run. Run. Mm, I will run. I will run the for the bread in the morning <laughs> <laughs> you're going to yeah, I mean, you, you will you will run for i mean to buy the bread yeah okay <laughs> ah yes because sometimes the the seller goes fast and you have to go after after him or she if not you are going to be without bread okay good uh, let's see Francisco. Uh -huh. Okay. Make a sense uh -huh. one of those. Okay. Uh -huh. One day, I will write a book telling my history about my life. Ah, that's great. So you, well, you will write a book. Yes. That's 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 nice. Uh let's see who am I missing? Uh, let's go back with uh, um Evelyn. Yes. Now make um, a sentence with read, listen, or write or write. Um I'm going to read a new book. Okay, so you will start to read a new book. Okay, very good. Uh, Diego? Let me see. Uh, I'm going to listen to music when I'm uh, es que no sé, me tengo esa duda. <laughs> Which one? O sea, para referirme cuando, por ejemplo, yo digo, cuando esté haciendo when tal I, cosa. Uh, solo así, when I. When I am um, studying. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, I'm going to listen to music when I'm in the bus. Uh, going to the university. Okay, so when, when, when you are on the bus, uh, going... I mean, on, on your on your way to the university. Ah, yes, yes. Okay, okay, good. Uh, uh, let's see. What type of music do you? I mean, do you usually listen to? Uh, random music. <laughs> <laughs> random. Music. I don't know. Sometimes, K-pop, uh, hip hop, uh, reggaeton, pop. 
<laughs> I don't know. All that kind of, of stuff. Ah, okay. So you didn't have like a specific uh, type of music that you listened that you listen to the most. Yes, except merengue. Merengue. Or, <laughs> or uh, regional music. Ah, uh, okay. Except that. <laughs> so those ones so you are not, uh, so we are we are not going to find those type of um, music in your playlist. Okay. Uh, so so no no merengue, no uh band music, regional music, ranchera music. Yes, that 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 music uh, I don't like. I don't know why, but no. Okay. Now yes, there are some type of music that makes me feel like I mean like like hot. I mean hot like about like a weather. Uh, talking about like the weather to have calor, I don't know. There are some music that make me have that effect. That is why I don't listen to them, and it's kind of weird. Uh, uh, okay, let's see. We're going to finish with... Uh -uh. With Doris. Okay. Which is missing? A uh, ride. Ride. Um, he is going to ride his bicycle in the park this afternoon. Okay, good. Ride the bicycle. He is going to ride the bicycle in the park. Okay, good. Very good. So I think it, uh, we're going to stop uh, here. It seems that it's already 10, 10 3. So tomorrow uh, we're going to continue with the next uh, topic. I mean, this is going to be the last week. So we, it means uh, that we are just missing three more classes. Tomorrow we are going to have, I think, that the, the last uh, topic. Then on Wednesday and Thursday, so we are going to be like working on some on some activities to reinforce like the the speaking speaking part. So uh so that will be it for for today. Thank you again for joining to the class. Uh, I don't know if you have any questions about the topic. No. no. Okay. Okay. So if you don't have any questions, so I wish you that you have a good night. Take care and I hope to see you tomorrow. Thank you, Thank teacher. You see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Take care. Have a good night. Thank you. You too.